Hey, welcome back to my playthrough of Cyberpunk. This is episode 51. Set up right under Arasaka's windows and crank it loud. Blast the pains out. It'll be a gig to remember. Yet at where the exact number of people killed and died. But our reporters are on the scene at Arasaka Tower. And they all agree. A psychoactive agent has been dispersed at the site, affecting those in the crowd. All right. Okay. What now? You recording this whole thing? Uh huh. Why? Want to say a few words to the folks at home? Do what you gotta do. Just stay out of my way. Let's start shooting. Thompson. Know him well? No, why does it matter? Don't like the guy? Don't trust him. And medias are bad luck. What? Bad luck. Say someone finds a tape later. A tape of us breaking into Arasaka Tower. Worry about that if we make it out. Come on, we don't have much time. Mainframe. Gotta find the mainframe. Great. Now focus. Ready or not, here they come. Good, good. Keep that up. Get the angle on him. Roger. Ready or not, here they come. Unit down. Can I, uh, no, don't have any netrunner capabilities. I'll get it open. Cover me. this thing. Ready or not, here they come. Get ready. Get ready. Your head. Yes, I can't freaking see him. Finally, this mainframe. Oh. So thick we could use a tank. Solutions, anyone? Let me try. Son of a bitch! Kaboo? Kaboo. Try this. Huh. Now I see why we brought him along. Arm the explosives. Oh. Three, two, one. How can he not die? Everyone else just dies. Oh, because these guys are not the same kind of guys.
There's one left, I think. Shoot! Shoot! Can you hear him? I would advise you not to disturb her. What'd you do to Alt? I put her to work on a project of a lifetime. Get out of my way. Uh-oh. Now her mind is gone. Alt. Alt, come on, don't do this. Is she? He's dead. Fuck! Johnny. The hell are you doing? Are you still rolling? This is all we can do now, my man. <laughs> won't change her. She's not. Johnny! Stop that! You have to kill him? We gotta go. Johnny! She's dead. Yeah, we lost her. We lost Alt. That sucks. Well, spit it out before you burst. Whatever happened to Thompson? Thompson. What happened to him? Dunno. Never worked together again. Maybe because you whooped his ass to make yourself feel better. Guy was a vulture. Out to use Alt from the start. When Arasaka flatlined her, man, for him that was sprinkles with the cherry on the top. Fuck, he would have killed her himself if they hadn't, just for his cockrod story. Never told me all of that about Alt, nothing close. Wow, what a real douchebag. Never even told me half that about Alt. Really? Any examples? I don't know. That you were a couple. That she rode Soul Killer. That she's dead. How the hell is she supposed to help us now? As a ghost. She's not dead. Managed to escape. I saw the body. Alt fled. Into the net. You're pushing bullshit. Heard more than my share of tales about runners who ran off to Never Never Netland. Just never thought you'd be the next to tell me one. Don't need you to believe me, long as you do exactly what I say. When'd you find out? When she made contact a little later. And? What did she say? That she was a captive in the Arasaka subnet. But they couldn't hurt her. And she told me not to come looking for her. What? Why? This one time, she wanted me to just let it go. Cause enough people had died for nothing already. So, what did you do? Got my hands on two thermonuclear charges. Then headed back to Arasaka Tower. That watch could have tracked all down by now. Rogue went with you again. Rogue went with you again. I paid her well. Said it yourself, she was the best. Had her pick of contracts. But for some strange ass reason, she took a job from a rocker with a death wish. A rocker, forever getting his ass beat by Arasaka. Different times, kid. Back then, Marks didn't normally sell out to corpse. All you had to do was yell, let's fuck up Arasaka, and every last one of them jizzed their pants. Rogue included. How do you know Alt's still around? It's been half a century. Which you've spent cloistered in Makoshi. Netwatch could have hunted her down years ago. Oh, they tried, believe me. But their tiny corporate brains can't handle a free AI that knows how people think. They were busy looking for her in the Crystal Palace while she was building the ghost city for King Tao. Voodoo boys think they know where she is. Beyond the Black Wall. Where nobody can touch her. 
And Brigitte's primed to go there. Break through. Just to contact Alt. Talk to her. ka -ching. Turn to BBS. Getting back here. It worked. Felt like more than a moment. Sure felt like more than a moment. Saw a good chunk of Johnny's life. And Alt. It is possible. Data connected to Alt are linked to a strong memory trace in the construct. Very strong. These memories must have evoked a powerful emotional response. Then projected onto your consciousness. Emotion, yeah. Plenty of that. Construct, what kind of shapes it in? Enough data is uncorrupted to convince Alt it is authentic. What the hell does that mean? So, did it work? Yes, we extract the necessary fragment of Silverhand's Angron. We are ready now to make contact with Alt. First, we must dive deeper. Beyond the Okay. Few have gone through to the other side, and none have yet returned. She will be the first. Before we cross the back wall, remove the construct. So I don't actually know what's on the other side. So, actually, you got no idea what's beyond that thing. But we will know soon. And these shapes I'm seeing. Wild, unfettered AI. Searching for a passage. We're across the black wall, remove the constructs. I held up my end of our deal. Your turn. Before you pass through that wall, I want Johnny's psyche removed. We will not pass through. You will take the code to the other side. Fuck. Might have guessed. Never had any intention of helping me, did you? It does not matter anymore. You will bring all to its end. Don't got much for options, do I? Ali. Touch the black wall. What the hell is this? How do I get to the other side? Rashid? Talk to Alt. Am I on the other side now? Wait, what? Alt! Johnny. Is that Alt? You cannot remain here. Alt Cunningham. Joris. Yap attacking network lab. What the hell's going on? They breached our BBSs. We have nothing to do with this. Network. We... Okay, and now we are. Uh... Network cannot touch me here. It's really you. What happens out there? Couldn't just take him out. That watch was well prepared this time. Gotta be Mosley, the fucker. What if Brigitte and the Voodoo Boys? I was forced to purge them. That watch was exploiting their BBS. Purge? You mean they're dead, all of them? Not actually gonna feel bad for her, are you? Damn it! I brought that watch here. Agent I dealt with must have slipped me a tracker that let him right in. Switch things up on the sly, replacing the Voodoo's virus with his own brand of fraud. Yep. Probably how they got to you. It matters not. The entire subnet was destroyed. Alt, you pulled us out of there. That mean you and us were okay? Everything's chill? I have recognized your engram code, but I do not know why you are here. So you can pay me back for getting you out of our socket tower. What? V, 
This is Alt. Best Netrunner Night City's ever seen. Alt, this is V. You need to save her life. Don't got it planned out. Question is your fee. The relic is killing me. As you can see, Johnny's got it all thought out. But there's the question of what you'll want in return. Netwatch propaganda has been effective. Do you see me as a demon who requires a pact signed in blood? I don't know who you are, I just want to survive, live on. Got no clue who you are now. Know a little about who you were. And John, that he was important to you, while I'm no one. So I'm asking, what's it gonna cost? I cannot help you. Can't or won't? Can't. To attempt to do so, I would need access to more advanced technology. You create a soul killer. Interesting. Bridget said it'd be possible. What? But it's your tech. You created Soul Killer. The program I created has little in common with how Arasaka has since repurposed it. Fine. So how about Mikoshi? That advanced enough for you? If I could gain access to Mikoshi, it would cease to exist. Good. We can work with that. We'll get you inside Mikoshi and you'll help V. Deal? Best runner Night City's ever seen can't bust into Mikoshi on her own? I am a well-known threat there. They have a layer of black ice with my name on it. Literally. Kind of like a custom-made prison jumpsuit. I refuse to be caged in there ever again. What can you do for me, exactly? Everyone I've met so far says I'm too far gone. By everyone, you mean Hellman? Saburo's personal ass munch? With the Soul Killer resident inside Mikoshi, I will create a construct of you, then disentangle your neural network from Johnny's. I shall then inject your engram back into your mortal form. So, you'll save my life, but flatline me along the way. Your consciousness, neural engrams, will be recorded as data. The rest will cease to exist. The rest? The soul. I did not grant the program its name. But Soul Killer does precisely what it promises to do. Christ, I don't want to listen to this bullshit. V just hops back into her body, right? Nothing changes. Everything changes. You know this well. Great, so we got a plan. Not a good how plan. how will you reach Mikoshi? I've created armies that failed to breach it. They were children of the net. There's your problem. We're banking on the human fact. V's got a big, dusty nomad family, and they'll do anything for her. We'll crack a window, slip you into Makoshi. Johnny gets gone and exaggerates sometimes. Johnny embellishes, in case you hadn't noticed. You don't trust him, which is fine. But you have my word we'll slip you inside Makoshi while keeping you out of harm's way. I believe this human factor and I have things in common. So, we agreed? Yes, we are agreed. Find a path into Mikoshi. I shall prepare a program to help you navigate the local net. How will I contact you once I'm ready? This is a BBS address. It will be our secure communication channel. Alt, before you leave, we gotta talk. Just you and me. No, that will not be possible. Okay. I'm out of the water. Could everyone's think of a dead. more fitting end. Runner Fox had it coming. As much as it tickles me too, we got a Delta. Right, still got Mr. Grumps left. System collapse. What do you have? Let's back up. Spots, gun. What do you have? Oh, circuit, nice. What do you have? Legion. Ooh. No, we can't connect. Okay. Let's get out of here then.
He's like stuck in the corner. Take everything and get out of here. Woo! Open! Get out! Whoa, are we collapsing again? Yes, we are. This is not good. Third trimester cramping. Of course, it's the bio sheet. <laughs> Third time. <laughs> no. Third trimester cramping. Ha ha ha. Really Joke funny. Away. But you look pretty spent. Fuck. That was your ticker. Sit and rest. Don't need your flat running while we got a job to do. Blah blah blah. Fuck Arasaka. Blah blah. Smash Makoshi. You really are turning into me. Don't smoke, not good, you're a brick. Can't say I'm excited, because you're a manipulator, an egotist, and a cynic. Every time you open your mouth, you gotta bury someone. You know, we get along as the need arises. Maybe it's time you started trusting me more. But I don't even like you. Problem is you think the end just by the means. Don't even know where I'm going. No idea where I'm going. Be a living legend. <laughs> That's all I wanted. Feels like I'm barely surviving. Test of a person's true value? Death. Facing it. Staring it down. You still got a chance to be somebody. Maybe. Bullshit. Yeah. Maybe. When you died, what was it like? What was it like? When you died. What's on top of the world? Failure, not an option, not a thought. Till it happened. Death feels real now. It's only now I know it. Now? I had half a century to come to terms. Makoshi felt, I don't know, like sleep? Lacked awareness, had no sense of passing time. Didn't mark it. Did what they wanted to me. I just remember cold, black void, fear. Or, or was that your death? Yes, I understand why you hate Mikoshi. Got what you deserved, Stan. Let's get going. Why did Arasaka build that place? Mikoshi. Why did Arasaka even build it? If I could only see inside Saburo's head. Ah. People can be bought, 
brainwashed. But it's only in Makoshi that you can peer inside a soul, pick it apart, reprogram it. They've amassed quite a collection. Scary, talented runners, soul killed, packed away. Probably using them now, probably controlling them. So, wool in hearts and minds, that's what it's about. Uh, the usual. Corps have always tried to shackle people one way or another. Saburo's ambition is greater. He's out to control humanity. Guess I understand why I hate Mikoshi. Well, oh, I think I get why you detest the place. Shouldn't exist. Of all the destruction and pain corpse wreak around the world, what happens at Mikoshi is worst. Know why? Eternity lasts forever. I don't know. you're trapped there forever. It's eternal. No, nothing's eternal. And for the Psyches and Mikoshi, no such thing as the passage of time. Worse things when they switch up your identity. And you never even know you've become someone else. Corps have already taken the world for their own. Now they're coming for us. Realize what you're doing to me is what Arasaka's doing at Mikoshi. Yeah, I know. That's why I'm gonna fix it. Let's, Let's go. Get back to work. Let's do. River Ward, we got a message. Hey V, hope everything's alright with you. Thanks for dropping by, I had a really good time. Thanks for inviting me, I had a nice time too. Your family's awesome. Well, my family thinks I've got an awesome friend. So what do you want, River? Just as hi, you have no idea how nice it is to see her smile again. Thanks for everything, V. You should come over again soon. Next time I'm buying dinner, thanks. See ya. Okay. Our crazed Ronin shows no sign of slowing his roll. We barely get intel from Wakaka about the braid, and Takamura's already hatching some hair braid scheme in Japan Japantown. He wants to meet at the market, fine, let's parlay, but you already know where I stand. Don't let him strong arm you into anything. Who knows how many loose screws are bouncing around in that skull of his at this point. It's truly wonderful seeing you again. Hey, what's up? The city is paralyzed with heavy traffic. Escalating gang wars in Haywood, the corporate AV catastrophe. A trying day for taxi services citywide. Can imagine. Night City can kick you in the ass sometimes. True, but it can also produce tremendous opportunities like no other place on Earth. Actually, like this city, huh? I'm afraid the reasoning satisfactorily answer your question falls outside my established parameters. Relax, Del. You shared the road enough times for me to know you're not some soulless machine. You. You really think so? Apologies. I must say goodbye now. Hey, dude. What's up? Uh, you know, same old. You? I'm thinking about you. Seen good days and bad days. Thought I'd never hear from you again. <laughs> Funny, I was just thinking about you. So, do I got amazing timing? Or are you always thinking about me? I'm always thinking you know, about I you. I could be cursing your name <laughs> in my thoughts. Oh, hey. I'm just glad you remember me at all. Because I got a favor to ask. As to your heart's content, got a job for me? Ask away. It's never boring with you. Interesting people well, that's aren't true. easily bored. Not in your company. Okay, now that we've blown each other, what's up? You're on a need-to-know basis. So, this mm -hmm. particular mission don't require you to have no gun. Just a wetsuit. Wetsuit? Which women? Say I'm intrigued. Why the wetsuit? Can't back out now. Just gonna have to use your imagination. Really know how to reel me in, don't you? Get away from here. Ain't seen nothing yet. Hey, All right, then, kill me in. But I gotta warn you. I look great in a wetsuit. Believe it when I see it. I do. Damn out past Rancho Coronado. Know it? Nope. Sure. What about it? Little uh, abandoned bungalow lakeside. 
Meet me there. At sundown. Okay, there's, there's a date to see you there. Don't have time, sorry. Okay, um... Is this a date? Guess you'll have to find out. <laughs> we'll have to. Oh my see ya, god. I do not understand. Does Arasaka not have enough of its own people? You'd steal your body for Look around, sir. Things are heating up. He's got the gift of the gab. Can't be denied, but I need to steal your body for a sec. What are you? What are we doing here? Good to see you, Goro. Why? What are we doing here? You shall learn soon. Teams remain in critical but stable. I acquired some information of my own. Do you know who most wished to honor Arasaka-sama with the parade? His murderer. The irony makes me sick. Don't see what that gets us. Thought Jory wasn't one for tradition. Still don't see how this gets us anywhere. I have had an idea. Look to the sky. The dash floats will pass precisely this way. If I could just get onto Hanako-sama's float, I could speak with her in private. Get there how? Why jump? Of course. And how you aim to do that in front of everyone? Think you might lose it, might have lost it. Impossible, even with implants. B? You are not shit crazy. In front of a crowd? What about security? Or you need not to worry. While you are occupied with your shady dealings, I learned more about the floats. They are all kept in one place, Arasaka Industrial Park. It is there that they prepare them. We need only to break into the compound, find the right float and inject a virus into its system. You will then be able to disable any security before I sneak inside. Well, sounds doable. Lots of ways to skin this particular cat, you know. Gonna need. I know what you need. It is taken care of. I have an infected shard. It was not cheap, but the man who sold it to me guaranteed it will work. Where'd you get this shard? Across the canal. Kabuki. Might actually be half decent soft then. And if it isn't, got a few tricks up my sleeve too. This is good to know. Are we Let us move on. Did she put that in her brain? We know it's a virus on it. What the hell? To take control of the float is one thing, but not all. The security concerns me, the snipers especially. I will be an easy target, but I may have an answer. Okada-san mentioned the city cameras. If we gain access to them, we will see exactly where the snipers are. You can deal with them as I advance. Sounds like a plan. Why is the dirty work my job? Sounds like a plan. You agree just like that? The risks are considerable. Yeah, well, get more and more used to that. And now, what would you say to a small test? We must try the shard. The camera control room is in front of us. You must get inside and infect the network. That is all. Uh-huh. And in the meantime, you'll do what? Crack open a can of suds? I will not touch alcohol. At work, I will watch your back. Now, get to it. Break into the security room. Okay, so that's this. We cannot just go in. Because I don't have the uh, ability to do that. So we need to find another way in. How the hell am I getting in then? There's no time to waste, B. Don't just walk in. I don't know. 
Final record, nice. Dude, what's this? You release brain dance. Ondubs. Ultra thin, ultra durable, nanotech tested and approved. Well, we're gonna need some of those, probably. Okay. Whee! There are no, like, security cameras in here or something. Look like it. Whoa! Hope there's glass on lots. What's an whore a diary? What the hell? Lime. No, we can't use that. We're gonna use this thing. X and chrome. Readable. Interesting. Okay, install software. Fucking worked. And what now? Go out again? Now the door is just open. Okay. And systems ours. Done. Systems ours. The shard works. Good. The easy work we have done. To break into Arasaka Industrial Park will not be such a bed of roses. But before we discuss that... Before we discuss that... Sit. I have not eaten since yesterday. Give me the best on the menu. I highly recommend the uh, yakitori today. Anything that isn't local, please. See you tomorrow. Can't believe I'm saying this, but this Saka scum might actually prove useful. He's a well-trained dog, needs orders, that's all. And when he outlives his purpose, we'll flatline him. See about that. Takamura's not a bad guy. Could still be dangerous. Chill, Johnny. He's Sokka scum to you. I know that, but Goro's not a bad guy. Not a bad guy. He was Saburo fucking Arasaka's bodyguard. Think his pretty eyes landed were. in that gig? What is this? Hey, Yakitori. Okay, I have laid the plan. One, we break into Arasaka Industrial Park. One and a half, hmm. we hack Hanako-sama's float. Two, during the parade, with my help, you eliminate any snipers. Three, I get onto the float. Four, I convince Hanako-sama of the truth. Done dumber shit than this before, so... Really ought to get us killed, aren't you? Five. Out of zero. You ought to get us killed. Well. Well, sounds like a suicide run, but done dumber shit than this, so. Things are even more stupid than stealing from Arasaka. None dumber yet, no. Set the bar pretty high with that one. Now, we part. Reconnaissance is required. You don't know this, it'll let me help. What do you okay. do? Don't let him off. Handle lots. Yeah, got enough on my plate as it is. I'll let you handle that. So I shall. Honizance. Cook! Louder! Louder! That is why I have decided to double the amount know. of our oh, active flash. Night City security forces. President Myers has he eliminated the, the last obstacle the between court. himself and the complete power. Of the and they surrendered it to him. Tell me then, what do we call the murder of my father? Was that not a provocation? 
Was that not a... Arasaka. An empire built to last. Before Yorinobu set fire to it from the inside. All of this began with him. The factions. Power struggles. All of this. Ksa. It's a very allowed to happen, Yoribono. Yorinobu, where do you get this rebellious streak? What are factions? Let's eat Be some. Whole frickin' ball. We got factions inside Arasaka? What are they? There are three. Kiji, Hato, and Taka. Kiji longs for stability. The old order. They are united behind Hanako-sama. The liberal wing, Hato, support Michiko-sama, Saburo's granddaughter. I know little about her. And then there is Taka, treacherous dogs who support Yorinobu. Not to mention even smaller factions. Tell me about him some other time. Where to get his rebellious streak? Where's Yorinobu's rebellious streak come from? No one knows this. Perhaps soon I shall ask him in person. Let's take another bite of this. Oh, I took two in one go. Well, why'd Saburo tolerate it all? Can't get my head around it. Could have kept his son on a short leash. Arasaka-sama was a strong and disciplined man. The strongest man I have ever known. And yet, at a critical moment, he showed a weakness. For Yorinobu. For his daughter. When Yorinobu formed his band of hounds, declared war on his own family, Arasaka-sama could have crushed him with one word. Yet he did not. For he did not wish his daughter to suffer. When Yorinobu returned, his tail between his legs, she persuaded her father to give him a second chance. Do you understand? Hanako-sama saved Yorinobu from the consequences of his deeds. Eat the final one. Might have a change of heart now. You blame Hanako for this too. Feels like that's about to change. As long as we get Hanako to believe our version of events. Conscience could also come into play. Assuming she's got one. We must reach her first. Time for some reconnaissance. Wait for my call. Hey. 